today we got a special video. There's a guy I work with, right? He's been through a lot. He lives in his car for one example and he works. So today we're gonna be taking him shopping. All right guys, we are at the Hagerstown. Was it Prime Outlets or Premium? Prime? I call it Prime Outlets. Yeah, Prime Outlets. What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Avery, aka Spoovy, as you guys like to call me. Today we got a special video. So, I don't know if you guys know, but I do this YouTube stuff during the week, but on the weekends, I deliver pizza at Domino's. Yes. So, anyway, there's a guy I work with, right? And he's been through a lot. He's, he's a lot older than me, but he's just been through a lot, like a lot. Like, he lives in his car, for one example, and he works, and... You know, it's just, it's crazy to me because you know he works so hard, yet he's living out of his car and he's just going through a lot of personal stuff. So I thought, um, you know, God might have put him in my life to, you know, humble me. But on top of that, I want to try to do something. Just, just this is just the person I am. I want to try to do something to enlighten him, enlighten his day. So today we're going to be taking him shopping. I'm going to be getting him um, a nice outfit for him. Uh, I'm going to see you guys when we go pick him up and let's get him. This man sent me a picture to my message on my phone and was like, what cologne should I get? Because I have two Versace clones and he bought one. And now here we are. He just sprayed it on. He smells good. He smells great. It's so, uh, I didn't want to be the one to do it. You don't have to go into sp any specifics. But tell the people a little bit about yourself. I worked my buddy here since April when I first started the job. Yeah. I'm still waiting on courts to get a hold of me because I went to late because my brother, I'm not going to say his name on why, yeah, yeah. he does that stuff, yeah. told Fib to, to my mother, which I was planning on leaving the house anyway, just not so quickly. Right. And long story short, by law, I have them beat in court by law because they broke one of the laws so, itself. Right, so pretty much your brother told the court or told the, the law or whatever a lie saying that you stole from the house or something when you didn't. Yeah, I told my mother that I didn't. And they kicked you out pretty much. Your yeah. mom kicked you out. And he says the big guy told him seven days when the law was 30. Uh, and I got proof on paper. Oh, that's right. So you, you're seven. supposed to have 30 days to leave. You're yeah, to get and days. I was given but seven. But you were only given seven. And I got proof on paper too, and she would be glad to say that he, he said seven when he know he didn't say seven. Right. You're like, well, how do you know the difference? Because it says in the good book, obey the lands of law. The law says 30. Isn't that proof enough? The book says it, which means he's lying in the big guy's name, yeah. so I pretty much won this case. It's too, right. it's too easy. And pretty, yeah, and pretty much. Yeah, you, you didn't say anything. You have everything to back up the fact that you're going to win this case. Oh, uh, no, I know I am. Yeah, and you're just waiting for the court. So, at the, end of the, the end of the, at the end of the day, you didn't steal nothing. You were just kind of cheated and robbed out of what, you know, where you were staying. Yeah, I was planning on getting out within the next two months at that time. Mm -hmm. And it got short by one week instead. Right. And I've been living in my car, which is actually very comfortable. And I had a chance a while back, over this past summer we just went through, to actually get a place. So I chose a motel. So I've been staying there, and this past couple paychecks, I realized I didn't have enough money to even pay for myself or the, or the place I was at. So I was like... So you had to pick between your cell phone or to keep staying at the motel? Exactly. You so I'm not stupid. I knew that that phone has got to be on at all times because they call it any time. Yeah. But it's because they're so busy. You know? For work and stuff too. Yeah. But definitely. So I chose my cell phone. Heck with them. I'm in my car now. Ain't no damn difference. I mean, it's comfortable to car. I got plenty of money to keep paying for the gas. Plenty of every paycheck. Right. Other thing, other thing right now that's battling me is the seats don't lay flat like a bed does. But other than that, right. I can always find a way. All right, guys, we are at the Hagerstown. Was it Prime Outlets or Premium? Prime? I call it Prime Outlets. Okay, Prime Outlets, either way. Uh, as you can see, he's in his work uniform because he don't have much clothes and stuff. And you know, he has work at five. So we're gonna get him right, get him, some nice, get him a nice outfit. And yeah, let's get it. <laughs> you see the drip? I got a couple of good clothes left, but I don't feel like dressing the car and being new in the car people look at me. Yeah, it's called Match of Holidays.
moving to me right now. It's like 36 You want the you want it's the same material, but do you want I like the cuff. I like the cuff better. But do you like this do you like this better? What do you like better? Do you like Probably something like this. With the open at the bottom? Yeah. Okay. I do that reef. He likes uh, he likes he likes cargo pants because one they come with side pockets and you know he, he he likes to carry a lot of stuff, especially really inside his car too. So Oh yeah. So like <laughs> So pretty much like I could come out here and you know put them in ripped jeans and you know a lot of stuff like that, but I'm not here shopping for me. Like I'm shopping for him. So I'm going I'm looking for stuff that's nice, but that he likes, not that I like, if you don't get what I'm saying. Because it's just like, I see a lot of people that's done stuff like this, and they're like, getting them like, Balenciagas and like, crazy shit. When this dude's like, very sincere, like, and he doesn't care about, he don't even know about that kind of stuff. Like, so like, I'm going to get him what he likes, and what I think looks good, as in matching. Got him some. We got him some black cargo pants from Gap. Found some nice pants. So we're gonna go to Zoomies. Uh, look for a comfortable pair of shoes and a nice shirt to go with the cargo pants. <laughs> the factory of New Balance reminded me about balance. When I grew up. For y'all probably even thought of it anyway, like 90s and 2000s, they always told, told people like me, ballet is, is for women, not for guys. Because it's, it's she was guys that they bunch of sissies. Here's the thing though, ballet teaches you balance. Those who have ever heard about Bruce Lee, he mastered the ballet. And look how much of a fighter he was. He was unbeatable. Yeah. All because of ballet, teaches you how to stay balanced. Me, I suck at it, but I'm getting there. Zoomies really didn't have much. We're gonna try New Balance. Uh, yeah. Wow. They actually feel perfect. Yeah. Play your roof. Oh, oh, this is wrong. I was looking at the wires, but this will be all right. Got you shoes, shirt, socks, and pants. Full outfit. All right, guys, that's gonna wrap up pretty much today's video. We got them the whole outfit. Uh, hope you're happy with the purchase. Oh, yeah, brother. Always, always. But anyway, man, hope you guys enjoy. Make sure to like, subscribe, turn that post notification bell on so you don't miss out on, on a video. And uh, Tim's going to sign you, sign us out with uh, stuff like a Thanksgiving turkey, Jim Carrey. Let's get it. Let's do it. There you go. Hold it.